Well, Terry, another pre-season friendly down. What was your assessment of it? Um, we weren't very good first half. They were sharper and quicker and on the front foot and better than us, to be fair. And um, we conceded a poor goal from our point of view. And then second half, I thought we changed the tactics a little bit, which we were always going to look at anyway, and that opened the game up. Um, so it was, there was chances either end. Um, but I thought it made for an exciting second half, and I thought we did much better. Obviously, first half, just struggling to get that ball to stick in the forward areas, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. I mean, they were right up for it. Um, big, strong boys at the back, so it was never going to be easy. Local derby were on their patch. Um, and there was a good crowd on, and there was a bit of an atmosphere, and, um, and that got louder and louder as the night went on. Um, so fair play, I think you've got to give Fylde great credit for the way they went about it. Um, some nice footballers, played some good stuff, caused us some problems. Um, and as I say, their, their main forward scored a good, you know, got a good goal from their point of view. But from our point of view, we've got to um, we give it away, which wasn't great. But then it's still got a lot to do, and uh, we've got to do better. Yeah, you mentioned causing problems at, at this stage of a, a pre-season. That's always good because it gives you the time to work on them. Yeah, um, there's loads of work to be done from tonight because we, I thought the enthusiasm and the, um, the togetherness of the lads and how they went about it to try and get the equaliser, which they did, uh, you know, that really shone out in the end. Um, but we weren't at the races at the start, so yeah, you know, you've got there's plenty to work on, attacking and defending, and certainly that quality of, of making the ball stick and. Um, it doesn't half help when you can retain possession and build up your moves. Uh, we didn't do that first half and we paid the price. You mentioned the change at half time, the tactical change, it seemed to help on the counter attack to, to create more free flowing football. Well, it definitely opened up and, and um, the game was wide open, if you like, and it's something that we've, um, we were always going to look at. And um, it did make for an exciting game and an end to end game. And um, we definitely did better in the second half. Um, uh, the way we played, it gave them some chances. Uh, in the end, I thought probably the 1-1 the one, one was a fair result. Forwards always live on goals. Nathan Delfonso has got two in, in three days now. That'll only boost his confidence, won't it? Yeah, you know, Nathan's come back and good nick. And, um, you know, it's a terrific goal. Thought, as I said, the spirit and that. And it was Tilty taking throws and running down the wing and putting pressure on then another throw. And then Tails did ever so well to, to play forward for himself and then pass the ball out wide. Mark Bowler's ball was... Fantastic, and Nathan gets himself between the sticks, and um, he scored an identical goal last season. I can't remember who it was against, but um, and that's where you need to be. You know, your forwards need to be between the sticks and getting on the end of those, you know, those delightful balls. Yeah, and doing that, it, it picked up a bit of a knock, and Ryan McGoughan came off first half. What's the news there? We will just assess. We'll just assess. Obviously, Ryan's uh, coming late, he's ca catching up. We decide him to start him tonight. Um, so we, I don't think he's done too much, but we'll have to see. Uh, Nathan got something at the end. Um, so we'll assess them all, um, brush them down and, uh, and see where they are on Thursday. Obviously, Mark Cullen missed tonight just as a precaution, really, but he's going to be fine, isn't he, because he's yeah, trained, has yeah, he? Yeah, 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 just precaution. Uh, got a knock at Nantwich and come off. So uh, we just looked after him. Um, Jimmy Ryan. He's doing more now, so we're getting closer. And uh, as I say, hopefully nothing serious tonight, and uh, um, have a head count on Thursday and go again for crew on Saturday.